or out of the room. But you of need to be able to walk backwards to do that. Welcome back YouTube, this is another Let's Play with Toe Clan in my modded world, and this will be episode 17. Doo, doo, doo. Uh, not that great of an achievement, but anywho, um, uh, I've, I've been reading your comments, don't worry guys, and some of you have been telling me to upgrade my EE, well I had like two or three pre-recorded episodes there, so when the new EE came out, I already had some episodes recorded of the previous EE. So I have upgraded to EE2 1.34 or something like that, I think. Um, and uh, yes, and like my transmutation tablet, it's all been emptied out and I actually accidentally did something stupid because I didn't think uh, this this thing here changed but I, I emptied this into here and when I came back it was all gone all gone so I have no food and I have no extra mats no wheat um, how does I get wheat in the first place? I believe I had a farm over here. Like I said, it's been... I had three pre-recorded messages, or um, episodes, plus I, I've been kind of skipping every every second day or so. Oh, my wheat's gone. Ah, uh, alright. Guess I need to make some wheat. And uh, I'll need to go find a, a pig, because I'm going to need some pork. Hmm. Now I knew... oh! Nice and close. Fortunately I don't have a sword with me. But I got two pieces of pork, so it's all good. Chicken, big pile of horses spawned. You stay off my farmland. You too. Go. Okay. Stop jumping on my farmland. I'll drill you to death. Okay. I'm gonna go and cook up this meat. furnace. Ah, it already took it. Um, I believe that will send it to this chest. So I'll get that in a second. Okay, so raw pork chop. And come here, cooked pork chop. Thank you, hello. Cooked pork chop. Okay, so I actually want a bunch of cooked pork chops, so I'm going to take a piece of gold. Probably not smart. Target my pork chop, put in a piece of gold, and grab a stack. Half stack. Okay. So now I have food. Might as well throw torches in there. And I need, um, another piece of gold, actually. Need some wheat, some raw pork chop. The reason I'm carrying around raw pork chops is so I can tame stuff. Tame the animals. Um, I need some bones. Grr. Grr. That makes me angry that all that stuff disappeared like that. Um. Oh well, whatever. Alright, so I didn't really plan this episode. I kind of just yeah, jumped into it. Tell you guys that I uh, got my next uh, version 
installed so you don't have to worry about uh, continuing to tell me oh upstate your EA oh, it's done don't worry about it and I'll throw in one of these I guess and um, man I'm missing so much stuff arrows, bows, swords, pickaxes I don't really care for pickaxes actually, but swords. I need a new sword. Um, where art thou? There you are. I need a diamond sword. Oh, I believe I had it enchanted too. That sucks. Um, oh yeah, I was making chests. I'm gonna go have to. I'm gonna have to go re review my other episode. All right, just so I can get back on track. Okay, so I want two more gold swords. Do, do, and do, do. Um, just for spare. What else am I missing? Uh, maybe when I go review the episode, I'll use any eye to give me my items back. There's no point wasting resources for what I should have had. Um, yeah, I'm going to pause this for now, and then I'm going to go review my other episode and get back to whatever I was supposed to be doing that I said I was going to do, but I never did because I went off doing other stuff. Like starting a new series that you guys won't be able to watch for a while. Because I gotta finish recording of Terraria with Lightstar. But uh, you'll look forward to the next series after that. So, um, yeah, I'll be right back, guys. Alright, I'm back, guys. And I've watched my last video, and I went and did what I said I would. I went mining. And I used this, and um, 10 was way too fast. Uh, the the um, induction furnaces wouldn't keep up, they kept spinning it upwards. So, I reduced it to 5 for each machine. I think I'm going to put uh, 10 in the extractor and compressor and the recycling bins, but the macerators can stay with 5. And I finished uh, these three machines here. So now I have diamonds going galore, finally. And i um, probably going to have to get a couple more going for Eternalist Fuel. But uh, for now, it's good. So me flashing my inventory over and over and over, you probably assume what I'm going to be doing today. And you are correct if you assumed I'm going to be finishing my client star, um, Omega. So the recipe has been increased again in one point. 3 EE2 version EE2 um it's now 4 Klein star ends to make a Klein star's way 4 to make a dre 4 to make veer and 4 to make sphere and then 4 spheres to make an omega luckily i got one sphere done and i got one dre so Ah, uh, you do the math here, guys. I'm gonna require quite a bit more. Just saying. And I have got 440,000 um, EMC in my sphere right now. Out of the, like, 100 billion that you can put in the Omega. <sighs> this is gonna take a while. Okay, so. First things first, we want to make a crap ton of irons. So, let's make as many as I can. I think that's about eight, I think. I believe it's only eight that I can do. There we go. Okay, so four ends goes away. Four is ways will equal a dre. 
Oh my god, that's... That's gonna take forever. That's like... Half a billion diamonds right there. Jeez. Woo. Oh, that was close. Get out of here. You get out of here too. You're annoying. And you too. Get it. I want your experience though. Come here. Give me your experience. Alright. Um, yeah. That's gonna take forever. Oh boy. Yeah, no. I can't, uh, there's... How many did I do? I think I did eight there, right? Yes, I did eight. So, eight made me two's ways. So eight more, which is sixteen, will make me one dre. So 16 times 4, which will make me 1 veer, is Do this. Okay, so 16 times 4 equals 64. 64 diamonds just to get one veer times 4 equals 256 just to get uh, one sphere and then times 3, which is 768 more diamonds to get a omega. Um, yeah. Yeah, I'm not, nah, yeah, maybe when I get a, like, a whole production line of these going, like a billion of these, but, oh boy, not anytime soon. Okay, so, the next thing on my list is I'm going to set up some logistics and crafting stuff, guys, because I know a lot of you are getting peeved at me for needing to create things over and over and over that you've already seen. You already know that I have my automatic crafting tables. Um, probably going to need lots of redstone torches. Probably going to need lots of wood. Stone. What else will I need? Um, totally forget how to make half the stuff. I'm sure, some pistons. Maybe a thing of cobblestone. Don't need that anymore. I actually need my logistic pipes. The add-on for build craft which will make everything so smart and if you hear that sucking noise it's like my my saliva is going nuts right now for some reason it's like drooling all over the place feel like I'm smelling my favorite food and I just want to eat it Rah. you're gonna be like toe clan you're a fatty big old fatty fatty fat fat well wow. sorry guys very sorry. I'm, I don't have anything to say to that. No comeback for you. Um, let's see. Philosopher's Stone and uh, pipes. Gonna need these. Gonna need some stone transport. Don't think I'll need any wood. I'm gonna need these. And what else do I need? Uh, glowstone dust. And, oh yeah. Some sticks. I'll take a whole stack. Alright, so, first things first. I definitely have a big enough room for this. Now, the question is, is do I want it in here? Or do I just want a pipe like up here that will fulfill my request <laughs> uh, 
this is a hard one, guys. Um, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to have a pipe that fulfills my requests. And... Oh yeah, if you notice, I gave myself all my stuff back. I didn't want to bother with the... Um, finding it all again. And wasting materials making it. So, create myself my trusty ruby axe again. Thank you. And I'm going to have... this machine room down here. Because I don't need to see any of this. I might put like a trap door down here to get down here, you know, like so I can see what's going on. But uh, I don't think I s there's any need for me to um, see it all. Um, I'm going to need cobblestone and light. All right, so this is a good start here. Um, while I'm down here, I can um, I'm gonna go ahead and create all the stuff I need. So I need some glass, actually. So glass, there you are. Create. Okay, so I want. No, I don't want that. I want some gears. Sixteen and sixteen and iron. and 16 gold gears which actually turns into 18 now I'm actually being pretty crazy here because I don't think I need this many but I want to make sure I have enough so if I press R here, you can see that the crafting of a diamond transport set pipe is made by two diamonds and one glass. So there's two diamonds there. Now the basic logistic pipes is glass and gold gears and redstone torches. So I'm going to need some more redstone and I'm going to need some more glass. So, best way to do this for me right now is if I go over here and stick a diamond in here and a piece of glass in here. Actually, how much is a piece of glass worth? That's not a good choice. So, if I put a piece of gold, no, I don't want 2,000. Iron? Um, sure. I got enough glass for whatever I want. Um, bring that down. Okay, back down to my hole. All right. Um, ba -ba, create. Uh, so I want to do this. Redstone. I don't know how much I need, but I'll just take that many. Sure. Um. Torches, diamond tubes, gears, yeah, okay, 19, or 9, I only needed 18 of them, and glass. There we go, tons of logistic pipes. I'm going to keep those diamond pipes so I can make some more later, that's why I made so many. Okay, so I have lots of logistic pipes. Now, these things are pretty useless alone. However, I can create or craft them into other things. So, a logistic pipes with a glowstone dust on the bottom will give me a request pipe. 
on the top will give me a provider pipe. On the sides will give me a crafting pipe. But crafting pipes are what I'm going to be using the most here. So I'm going to use... Six for now. Oops. Okay. Now I want a couple of provider pipes. Um, I want one request pipe and some provider pipes. Oops. There we go. All right, so that's uh, basic, basic what I need for um, this stuff. Uh, yeah, something like that. So my request pipe is going to be all the way up there, and you know what? I'll just do this. Climb myself out of this pit. Let's hope that's deep enough. So, request pipe here, and it's grass. Quest pipe will go here. Okay, and then I need um, stone transport pipes all the way down. So when I request stuff up there, it will send the order down here, which will go to a bunch of crafting tables along this wall. sucks. Okay, I need some more stone pipes. Create and stone and glass and bam. Okay, stone pipes. Definitely way too many, um, but I'll use them later someday. Okay, so stone pipes. And... crafting tables, which should go here. No. Okay, like that. Alright. And then... Um... Crafting pipes here. Alright, so now when I um, go to craft uh, whatever I want here, I. Oops, I want my build craft wrench. Oops. <laughs> Man, 
And if I go like this. There we go. Fixed. Um let's see. Let's see what I can, what can I do? Um let's say I want some wood. So I'm going to say that the whoops. No, I was I was I was, I was going to go get my build craft wrench. That was what I was going to do. Um I'll say that input is one wood and output is four wooden planks and like you can see it only shadowed the items um, I can't get them back if I click them because they're shadows so in input what's import what's paint what is all this stuff I don't know I don't know anyway the simple way is input is one wood output is four planks so when I request um, whatever I request um, it will send the order and then the provider pipes from wherever I have chests set up, probably upstairs, so I can drop off all my stuff up there. Um, we'll send the stuff that's needed to be provided down here, and then it will go into the one that the crafting one that requested it, and it will make whatever it needs and send it back up. So if I need things that require multiple components and all the components can be made then it will send all of the items down and then it will um, create all the multiple items and then send all the multiple items to wherever it needs to be made and then make that and send it so this is how um, the logical system works if you didn't understand any of that well then wait till future episodes where I actually get this whole thing working um, for now I think I'm gonna end the episode cuz yeah it's been running on quite a while and uh, you know what I didn't get anything accomplished this episode kinda sad did most of my accomplishments off uh, off screen um, but yeah, sorry guys, that's that's it for this episode. Now, um, this is Declan, signing out. Look forward to the next episode.